Alrighty guys, uh, <laughs> we just got back to base from the Origins, and there's a level 540 Celestial Argy chilling in there with a, uh, it looks to be a Dark Mega Raptor. I am just going to honestly knock that Argy out. I was going to say it should not be able to get in here, but it looks like it is. Alright, I need to throw out Ash real quick. I'm a bit worried about throwing out Ash. Alright, alright, alright. Chill out, Algae. Uh, I don't even know if we can breed it with the one that we've got. It is... Oh, what did it damage? I'm hoping it didn't break anything. Okay, that's, that's alright. As long as it just doesn't break anything. Where's our Parasaur? Parasaur, Parasaur. Alright, there he is. Alright, it's asleep, thankfully. I'm hoping it didn't break anything in the base. We're going to come and kill this Dark Mega Raptor, though, for tons of feathers. I'm just going to chainsaw it up, I reckon. As soon as I find my chainsaw. All right, well, I mean, that's a solid start to the episode. An RG knockout. I am I'm just want to double check the base. Doesn't look like it damaged anything, which is... That's great news. Okay, good. So, I, I don't know what that damage number... Oh, hold on. Okay, must have hit the crop plots or something, maybe? I don't know. That's uh, nonetheless pretty... I mean, it's not weird, but I'm glad it didn't really damage anything. Let's get all these feathers here. Oh, yeah, that's better. All right, cool. Bit of feathers so that we can make some more kibble up. How much kibble do you need? You need eight kibble. We can actually use that. We accidentally put uh, some of the kibble into our Parasaur's inventory as well, and Ash actually ate it because... He was hungry and needed food, so I kind of feel... I mean, we lost a three kibble, I think it was, but it should be okay. What is that sticking out the bottom of there? Is that the kitchen? Yeah. All right, cool. So today, guys, yeah, we're going to be breeding... Oh, that was quick. I'm thinking we already have a male. Yeah, damn. Uh, 809, although I think this is stronger than our RG. 2.7 million health, 4.4k. Uh, 3.8 million health, 111, 102. 100, 131. It does have stronger melee damage. Huh. Okay, that's good to know. Alright, well, I mean, i got to put all this stuff away real quick, and then we're going to go hunting for some more demonics or uh, celestials. I want to get a thorny dragon as well as a breeding parasaur as well for Ash, so he's got a couple of friends to go along with. Alrighty guys, so we've got eight demonic kibble being made up. I'm also going to make the origin stuff. We need those. I think I can actually make ten of those because we've got literally ten blood. So we're making up the kibble. I'm pretty sure like three or four should be enough. Uh, as terms of feathers, after killing that dark mega raptor, it was actually a pretty solid amount. But let's come upstairs here real quick. Let's take a look. I've got to put some words on these guys so that we know which ones are which. I really hope you don't have your poo still going. Automation... Poop generation. Okay, that should be fine. What, which one is the Mega Raptors? Okay, so these guys... Maybe I have to actually enable mating first. Let's get these guys out. I think we'll just do it this way. I thought they were going to uh, automatically do it in there, but it doesn't look to be the case. We're going to come downstairs here. We're going to throw these guys out and let them... And let them breed so that we have a source of feathers coming in. Because we really need a lot of feathers. We, we've got the chainsaw. So all we need to do is just make sure that they get raised up. And then once that happens, we can just kill them. I know it makes me a bit of a monster. But when I need feathers, I need feathers. Alright. Let's enable mating. Enable mating and enable mating. Alright. And we should get eggs from that. They're getting jiggy with it. Nice. Okay. Uh, so we've got the kibble going. We've got the origin stuff going. Come back here, please. Elevator. There we go. I really am a fan of this base. Honestly, I'm actually in love with this base. It's so good. I can't wait to get more extensions on it as well so we can put the greenhouse and stuff. All right. Uh, origin. Uh, yeah. Oh, I need the 10 arrows. We're going to whack these in here. And craft all of those. So we're going to be able to breed the demonic parasaurs today. We should be able to breed them today, I think. If we can get this one tamed up. If we can get Ash a girlfriend. I don't remember what level Ash was when we actually tamed him. Can I get into that? Thank you. Please. Hello. 
Give me that. Yeah, I don't remember what level Ash was when we tamed him, but I mean, we'll find out here in a second. And get your Pokeball. Alright, who do we want to use to fly? Our oh, Archaeopteryx? Yeah. I gotta remember where it is. I think it was like somewhere over... It was near us. It was near the base. It was like over here somewhere. So we should see it pretty soon, and it should be relatively easy to hit with the Origin Arrow, I would say so. Deinonychus's a hyena don. Maybe I should tame up a fabled. Oh, hello. We got a chaos manticore over there. I am thinking. That we bring Ash out to play again. What level is it? It's only a level 80, so we should be okay. I should honestly probably be able to one-shot it. Let's power up here. The question is, do we want to fire it from a far way away? I don't think that hit him. Where is he? What is this darkness from? It's not from him, is it? Bro, you really don't want to do that. Okay, the manticore's up there. He's taken off in the sky. There's the bloody dragon that we were trying to kill. Is he just running away from us because he's chicken shit? Our beam attack doesn't go... Oh, here we go. Here he comes. Oh my god, look at him just get melted. To be fair, we did take a bit of damage there. Oh, let's get out of his lava. we got some solid element. I'll take the element and the boss essence. Nice. I'll grab the XP potions and that as well. We'll take all the ammo. Why not? Is that a prime hour? Yeah, that's prime. That's nice. All right, that's good. Okay, let's drop all of that. we got another manticore flag as well, which is great. Let's go back up here to our micro raptor and we can head on out and see if we can find that demonic parasaur as well. Alrighty, guys. Found the demonic parasaur. It's literally right outside the front of our base. There's also an apex magmasaur. And what is that? Another celestial argy. My god, these guys are everywhere. There's also a primal? Yeah, alright. We're going to come down here. I'm going to knock out this parasaur and then we'll kill the other stuff. Actually, maybe we'll tame it first so that it doesn't suffer any shots. I kind of also want that Apex Magmasaur because we don't have... I think our Magmasaur is an alpha. I wonder what took dealt the damage to this lady. Oh, come on. Okay, that hit. Run, run, run. Let's take off here. I'm glad we didn't hang around in there. All right, well, I mean, that's going to go to sleep. We've got the, yeah, I kind of want the Apex Magmasaur. 540. I don't think we have an Apex. I'm pretty sure ours is an Alpha. I actually need to tame a Griffin up as well. A lot of you guys have been telling me to tame up the Griffins. Because we don't have a Griffin. We can use it to get around and shoot off the back of and stuff. So I see your points. I do see your points. I just I haven't bothered to tame up a griffin. I don't see anything else around here. Alright, let's head back over here. Oh, hold on. What is that? That's just a normal Mesopithecus. Oh, buffoon. Okay. Um, I don't think there's any... Oh, what is that? A level 580 Celestial Rex. I feel like that's probably a really solid level. But in all honesty, I think we might just murder it, to be honest. I don't think there's much point in us. I think... Why didn't it flee go... What the hell? Why didn't it go out? Why didn't it get knocked out? We used the origin arrow. Oh, okay. That was super weird. Maybe it was because we... Um... I have no idea what happened there. That's fine. We're going to... Jump off here. How much demonic kibble did it want? Four? Nice. Alright. This means we can breed ash. Done. Level 560. What level to come out at? 839. Which I think is the same level as ash. So I think it was the same level. Okay. Let's leave you here. Let's grab... Ash back out. 
We're gonna kill these pri this primal and this alpha. Oh, the celestial idol. No, it looks like the primal raptor already killed it. No, no, they're still all over here. We're gonna kill these guys. We need primal blood, so I'm hoping if we bring out the I think I don't think we'll get much from using the from using the chainsaw, but I'm pretty sure we can try. I mean this raptor's dead. I'll wait for the flames to clear before we go ahead and try and harvest off the raptor. I'm also gonna kill this RG. That should, yeah, that should literally take one shot and it'll die. There's his body. We're just going to burn everything in the area as well at the same time. Alright, I'm just glad we don't take burn damage from that. Can you imagine how unpleasant that would be? Let's grab this extra stuff. Thank you very much for your kind contribution. Alright, and we can harvest up this bad boy. Give me all your hide. Oh, I love it. Look at it all. 5k hide from one bird. Nice. Alright, and we'll come back over here. I don't remember if... We get more hide, uh, more blood from harvesting up the primal raptors with our chainsaw, but we should be able to. No, only 46, which is kind of disappointing. We did get some more element, though. And some health potions, and some more ammo. I don't really like taking the blueprints anymore, because we have so bloody many of them. Like, actually, we have so much. Alright, that's fine. Uh, do I go kill that Celestial Rex? Or, and more important question, do I go and tame this Apex Magmasaur? Let's go for it. Uh, do I have the necessary stuff? I think I do. I'm not going to use one of the thingy uh, arrows. Where is he? Primal Tech Raptor. I feel like I should probably play it safe <laughs> and not leave um, Ash. Well, not leave. Yeah, not leave Ash's side. Alright, let's go kill this Raptor. Oh, I didn't mean to harvest it. Whoops. I was going to get the chainsaw on it. Alright, there's the magma saw. Shoo. 241k. I don't know how much these arrows are going to deal to it. Oh, wow. Quite a bloody lot. Oh, still going. That was one arrow. I'm using the... Yeah, I'm using the apex ones. Got him. Bro, can you not? You're a petty level 60 saber tooth. What are you possibly going to do to me, mate? Just die. You brought a friend. You thought the friend was going to help you. I do have arrows to use on these guys, but, like... We don't take any damage with, our armor, with the armor that we have on, so it doesn't really matter. Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to hit you. Alright, so we got that guy asleep. We need... How much kibble? Eight Apex kibble. Let's grab you, and... We're going to breed these guys when we get back to base. I'll grab the element and the blood. And all that good stuff. Alright, sweet. Okay, so already got in a new Celestial Argy, already got in a new Demonic Parasaur, so now we can actually breed them, have an army of Demonic Parasaurs, and then we can take on a boss. I know you're not supposed to be able to breed the Demonics and the Celestials, but I was kind of just like, hmm. See how we go. Alright, are these guys producing eggs? I don't know if anyone would grab the eggs. Nope, look how tiny they are. Pick that up. Now that I think about it, If I come in here, I know there's... Are these light mega raptor eggs? They are. Okay. Um, let's grab these out. And we can hatch these and just raise them up. I didn't realize that these were light mega raptor eggs as well. Because we can use these to obviously farm up a bunch of feathers. Uh, what I'm going to do is we're going to come over here and hit... Bloop. Oh, look at that. 5,790 items transferred. So good. Um, okay, I've got to put all these blueprints away, which is annoying. But that's fine. You can see here we've got three shelves of them. Put that away. Alright, nice. I don't need this manticore skin. I will put this flag up over here, though. Just to help decorate the base a little bit, you know? Alright, come downstairs. Let's get these eggs going. Um, hold on. Before we do, we need to grab our parasols out. And we want them breeding as well. Who has the high melee damage? Oh shit, she shits on Ash's melee damage. 148 natural points into it. Whereas Ash only had 111. What about health? 111, 121. But Ash does have a little bit of more health than the female. But that's okay. That's still pretty solid. Okay, let's hit behavior, enable mating, and enable mating. Also, I think we can upgrade his saddle. Yeah, we haven't even upgraded his saddle a little bit. Okay, these guys are breeding, so that's great. Let's 
Come back over here. I'm going to check if there's any more die bears. We also need some more primals. Rock Jake, RG, Wyvern, Rex, Spino, UD. Level 600 UD. That's kind of tempting. I'm not going to lie. That is kind of tempting. Uh, we want... Origins are being summoned in at the moment. They're still doing the summoners. Primal. Are there any near us? Wow. Where are all these Kanos at? 78? They're not near us, I don't think. They're all in different spots. I got excited. I thought there were going to be like a whole mass of them together. Looks like a lot of them are on that island. We can head over there and check it out. There's a couple of the Kentros that are also on the island. Megalodons, I'm not even going to bother. Okay. And then we've got Primal Raptors. They're kind of all over. Alright, who else I want? I want Tortuga. Master of the Seas. We want Tortuga because I'm pretty sure he produces Black Pearls. Uh, passively over time. So if we can get a Tortuga as well, that would be awesome. But I'm pretty sure we need Special Kibble for them. Okay, those guys are all breeding up. What we need are... Aircons. Aircons? Do I have any Aircons? I have two. I don't know if that'll be enough. I also need to drop all this shit. Okay, that's fine. Okay, Aircons, Aircons, Aircons. I'm just... Just to hatch these little babies. Where do we want to put them here? Yeah, I was going to say they should automatically be powered because we are in range of the tech gen. Alright, beautiful. I have no idea what these guys eat. I'm assuming it's meat, right? Or do you want an imprint on them? It's not going to make a difference because they're going to die anyway. Alright, you guys come over here. Come on. Come on. Okay, we got like two of them. That's fine, whatever. Uh, I'm pretty sure they eat meat. Alright, we got a demonic parasaur egg as well. Oh, that's actually incubating. Nice. Okay, cool. Uh, we need... Oh, we've got heaps of meat actually now that I think about it. How quick are they raising up anyway? 1.4. I want to try something. Okay, let me just... Uh, let me throw these out. Because all these guys are going to die. They're definitely going to die. I don't think I see a point in us keeping them all. I wonder if I can claim them with the S plus gun. Uh, vacuum pillar, light repair, remote dino. Kill, spay, chibify, claim. Okay. Oh my god, look at them all. This definitely works a lot better. I think we definitely got twins through here. Alright. That's pretty much all of them. Okay, what I want to try and do is if I come upstairs here, right? If we come into our tech rep and we go mutator. Transmutator, we don't want. The mutator. Unless there's the full power of element to alter dinosaurs in powerful ways. I'm pretty sure that this has a growth function. I'm going to make one of those. I'm also going to go Aggregator. Is that what it's called? What does this do? Collects and distributes many items from and to many different things. Alright, let's craft one of those up as well. Give me that. And we want the Mutator. We'll do the Mutator first because if I can get these guys to grow super quick, then we can just harvest them up. There we go. Alright. Let's put the mutator down. Oh shit, I hit whistled follow all, I think. Everyone chill out. Your egg should be just about to hatch anyway as well. Alright, let's pick that up. We don't want that hatching just yet. Of course you're stuck over there, Parasaur. Why do I always hit the bloody J key? Every time. Alright. Who's that? Can I hit you from here? I guess not. 
No, that doesn't reach. All right. Uh, you can get Pokeballs. You can get... Oh, we got a Demonic Egg. All right. Let's 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 put this Mutator down before I freaking forget and get sidetracked. All right. Mutator. Range. Access inventory. Is it working? I think we need uh, element for it. Change mode. I think I need element. All right. Let's come back up here. Uh, I'll take Jenny's upstairs. I don't like being having to withdraw so much. Wait, I think I have element on me, don't I? No, I must have put it away. Okay, let's see this. I want to see if this works. So if I grab some element here, right? We chuck that in there. And we go... Change mode. Assign gender. Allow breeding. Impulse. Freeze growth. Boost growth. Pretty sure it's brute boost growth. So if we hit that and we go create boost growth pulse. These guys should automatically get a massive... How much did that cost us? I don't know. Not much. These guys should start growing up super fast. Yeah, they are. That's working. Maybe I should have had the demonic parasaur out. That's actually super good. I don't know. The health is okay. They're all our babies though. I'm just going to make sure that we kill them. Oh, uh, that's what's up there in the freaking sky. Our other light, our other micro raptor. Okay, that's fine. You can get pokeballed. You don't have anything on you, do you? No. All right, you get pokeballed. You come with me. I'm going back up here in the castle. I almost feel sorry for all of these guys. Almost. I almost feel sorry for him. Claim, mating, whistles, following, wandering, creeping. What is creeping mode? Tart mode, kill mode. Kill mode. I'm pretty sure this will work. Are they fully grown yet? They're almost there. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is going to make life super easy if we can just claim them all. Like, uh, Not claim them all, sorry. Just kill them all like this. What we'll do is we'll drop this Parasaur Egg as well. I should have probably had this out for the growth spurt, but I can just do another one. We have heaps of elements, so it's not an issue. We'll probably need to go get any some more element anyway, because, I mean, we're a little bit short of it. But, like, this is our first bred parasaur. What do we got? Imprint on you. Once care. Uh, cooked meat. I can do cooked meat for you, buddy. There you go, mate. 100% imprinting. Done and dusted. Let's take a look. It is a male. Did it get the mum's melee damage? 148. I feel like it did. It got the dad's health, I think. Alright, cool. Uh, we need to not bother powering it up. I don't think it eats meat. No. That's fine. Alright, you just chill there, little dude. We're going to kill all your friends. Oh my god, look at all these mega raptors. We need to get some water first, though. I do feel sorry for what we're about to do. I feel incredibly bad. But I need the feathers. And this is, let's say, the fastest way to get the feathers. Oh, oh. Do I feel bad? A little bit. i got to make sure that I don't hit any of the teams that we actually want alive, like my Parasaurs. I feel terrible. I really do. Is that all of them? That, this is still that one, and there's one more. Alrighty, well, I mean, this is where things are going to get interesting. Let's see how we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at the feathers. Am I proud of myself? Yes. Do I regret my decision to harvest up these poor innocent souls? Not really, no. Does that make me a terrible person? Oh, absolutely. freaking lootly Okay, uh, <laughs> I can't even carry it all. What we'll do is we'll bring this one out and we'll go dedicated storage. I don't know how this works. You must wait one second between pulls. Oh, I don't want to pull it. Okay, there we go. So that transferred everything into the dedicated storage boxes. Now we can keep going with our harvesting spree. Yes, yeah, so uh, we're going to go see how many feathers we have after this. But I can guarantee you we're not going to need feathers for a while. I'm always out of freaking gasoline. 
Alrighty guys, after harvesting up all those light mega raptors, let's come in here and take a look. We've got about 1700 feathers of each kind, which is honestly a pretty solid amount. We're probably going to need more, so we'll probably have to do this again later down the line. But, uh, you know, at least we know now we can do it again and again and again and again and again. Um, this is a juvenile demonic parasol that looks very bloody. But that's fine, because what we can do is we can just come into here. I don't have any more element. I gotta carry some element on me because I I just tech dedicated storage boxed it so it went all the way. But what we can do is we can just come back down here for our parasol. We can go into you. We can go boom and we can go create boost growth pulse, and that'll boost the growth of this little dude. So we won't have to worry about feeding it. And that is things done and dusted. We are gonna keep breeding these guys though. I've got to get the hatchery back down. But before I do that, I need to um, get the greenhouse going because that's probably where I'll have it set up. In the greenhouse with the rest of the gardener and stuff like that. Alright. You're growing at a pretty solid pace. Where is your mum? Mating is in 8 seconds. So we can breed her. Or is that 9 minutes maybe? That's 9 minutes. That's fine. So they're going to get breeding. But we've got our own little baby parasol. Which means we can... Definitely breed these guys up. Uh, I will... I think I'll leave these guys out for the time being. You uh, are... You, did you get affected by that pulse? I'm going to bring you back over here. We'll see. I'm not sure if it's if it received that pulse or not. I still got to clean up all of this. But yeah, I am probably going to build the greenhouse next episode, I think. Just, I think that's what we'll have to... Well, I mean, we won't... We don't have to. But I think it'd be a better call to do it like that. Instead of... Um, deposit all. Three items transferred. Nice. Okay, let's put these away. For now, all these souls and stuff. I don't know whether or not to have kibble or to have it like souls. All these souls and everything we're just putting in this box. Uh, this tech storage box. Uh, boss essence can go in there as well. I'm going to try and use this aggregator. Because I have a feeling that if we've already got stuff put away, it'll this will help us. So what I might do is I might whack this over here. I have no idea what this thing does. Aggra activate show range distribution options. Poop to dung beetles, poop to compass bins, thatch to compass bins, fertilizer to crop plots, metal to forges, gacha crystals to cratcher, upload to dedicated storage. Wow, this is super intense and actually really good. Uh, show range, distribute collection options from the ground. Oh, wow, okay. So you can, I'm assuming this automatically transfers everything to where you go. So, collection from the ground, eggs, sterile. From things that produce. Done. So, I'm guessing it'll fare. I don't know. Is it just like collection distributes many items from and too many different things? So, if I whack some meat in here. I mean, it's not doing anything. I'm not too sure. We'll, we'll figure out what that does later down the line. I think it'll come in handy later. Alright, let's make another pulse. That sh It should have been hit by the first one. Maybe it's just slower because it's a higher tier creature. That's possibly my thought process. Alright, what I'm going to do is we're going to also upgrade this demonic parasol saddle. Uh, do, 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 do. Augment station, upgrade station. Demonic parasol, what do I need for you? Attempt upgrade. Demonic hide, fiber and wood. Demonic hide. Fiber. Wood. Alright, that should be more than enough. Fiber, hide, wood. Okay. 873 more demonic hide I can do. Nice. Alright, we can whack this in here. And then this should get our saddle upgraded to at least uh, Apprentice. Yeah, nice. I don't think we can go any higher. I think we need more demonic hide. But what we can now do is I'll grab all this stuff back as well. We can whack it in the augment station. Uh, put you in there and we can go damage, cold, armor. We want 10 of those. 
craft 10 of those bad boys. And then what we can do is we should be able to augment it to make it even higher armor. I don't know what the cap is on Apprentice. I'm going to say 600. No, it's still going. 700. Yeah, alright, cool. Well, I mean, we just went from a level 100 armored saddle to level 700 armor saddle. So, I think we'll take that. I think we will take that. I'm trying so hard to keep my inventory bloody clean, but every time I look in it, there's just more and more gunk in there. <laughs> like, what do I need? Why did I pick up poo for? Where did this poo even come from? I'll put that in there for now. We're going to use that because we can... That's stronger than our Ascendant one. We can make it stronger than our Ascendant one. So we're going to use that eventually. Uh, I don't need this. That can go in there. Oh, no, hold on to the rest. The darts actually... No, I don't need darts. Cool. And I'm going to put this up, but I think I need it on the trophy mount. So we'll whack this in here for now. All right, cool. Yeah, we have tons of tributes. So what are the next tier of bosses? I believe Celestial Indom and Demonic Reaper Empress. I think there's a Demonic Reaper Empress wandering around somewhere around here. I can't remember if she pulls us out of our power up or not, though. For the life of me, I just cannot remember. Alright, well, I mean, we're getting Demonic Eggs from these guys. I'm going to keep breeding them. Because, well, I'm pretty sure we need Demonic Eggs for stuff. I don't know what, but I'm pretty sure we need it for stuff. And then what we'll do is we should be able to build the greenhouse. Let's take a look here. I just don't know if I'm going to have to build some more foundations underneath us for it. I'm going to assume probably. Because, yeah, but we've still got, like, all these structures. So, building it's not going to be an issue, and we're going to get the hatchery and all that down next episode. Uh, we've got a transmitter, which I don't think we really need at the moment, because we've got the scanning thingy. So, I think that should be okay. You know what we will do? We're going to look for a celestial RG. Have I got any kibble left? I think I had one kibble. I've got three kibble, because we need a female celestial RG so that we can go ahead and... Get Celestial Eggs. So, let's go with 5 Kibble. We'll grab the scanner out. And Celestial RG. We need a female. God damn it, it's a male. Okay, looks like we're not teaming up a, male, a female RG. Need new die bears? No. I might have to do... Maybe the team up that thing I don't know. See if there's any new demonics. Yeah, see, here's the demonic reaper empress, level 700. Pretty sure she's, yeah, up in the redwoods. Thorny dragon, uh, and then a parasaur. Yeah, all right, nothing that we, I mean, are there any low-level females? 520, 540. And they're kind of far away. We're not going to bother. I don't think I have any more demonic kibble left anyway, don't I? I've already made up the freaking celestial kibble. I'm an idiot. All right, let's take a look. How much kibble have I got left? I got six kibble. Why doesn't it let me deposit the kibble? Oh, that's why. We were lagging. Okay, you know what? Parasaur. Parakeet fish school. Huh. Big parasaur. Nice. All right. Uh, what are we looking for? This one? 340. Do we bother? Eh, I don't think we bother. I think we just breed the ones that we have, and then we can slowly get enough so that we don't have to worry about uh, thingy. This one's taken quite a bit of time. I don't know if I have to just keep pumping up these uh, boosts, these growth boosts. Or what the dealio is, but I mean, we're slowly getting the eggs. Oh, wait, why aren't you mating then? Does this reset on being cryoed up? Oh, it must. Alright, well, I mean, I'm super glad that we came up with that idea to go ahead and... Uh, Harvest up all those Mega Raptors because we now have a decent amount of feathers and we can do the same thing with Celestials and Demonics once we start breeding them a bit more. So I'm super keen for that. Uh, but yeah, I think we're going to wrap the episode up here today, guys. We managed to get another Arj here. We've got the Parasaur being raised as we speak. That should be ready by next episode. Uh, we got another female Parasaur, so these guys are going to start producing eggs, which is great. I will probably these guys in maybe i don't know ash is really good i'm thinking we put those in the soul terminals maybe i'm not sure yet maybe once we get the hatchery down it'll be a little bit easier but we've got to clean up all of this first and then i want to pick up all of this so 
That's going to wrap the episode up here today, guys. Next episode will be some more base management. I apologize if you guys are getting sick of the base management stuff, but once we get it set up, it's pretty much going to be... Alrighty, guys, and we almost forgot about the bloody Apex Magma Saw. We knocked it out. Oh, it's working back up again. I completely forgot about this guy. We did knock him out and everything. We still got all our arrows and everything, so we're just going to knock it out again, and it should have some pretty drained food, I would say. And you're asleep. Yeah, it's lost a little bit of food. I don't know if it'll tame up straight away. And I did just put the freaking thingies away. Apex, kibble. Okay. I don't think it's going to tame up. I need that bloody... That's fine. We'll grab the taming helpers. I genuinely thought... I have just literally put it all away in the freaking base. So we're going to grab that. I can't believe I forgot about him. I, I don't know if this guy will be better than our... Than our alpha one, but I've got to assume that it would be right. Like, surely it would be better than our alpha Magnosaur. I would wager. I don't know. We're gonna to have to take it out and get some more metal to find out, I suppose. Uh, what am I looking for here? Team helpers. I'm gonna grab the 50 times because that seems to be the only one that will actually work sometimes. Okay, let's come out. Yep, I was like, I'm lost in my own base. Okay, let's go over here. Don't worry, Mr. Magnus, also, I'm coming to tame you. Alright. I think it's got enough kibble in it, that's fine. Let's get both of these in there. Honestly, I don't care. There we go. Yeah, see, it looks like it's only the 50 times that ever bloody helps. I don't know why, either. It's so weird. Alright, I don't think I'm going to need any more kibble. Done. Beautiful. Alright, we got ourselves an Alpha Apex Magnusaur. Which, honestly, yeah, I'm thinking it should be better than the normal alpha that we had. But, guys, that's going to wrap the episode up here today, guys. So, hopefully you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more, and I'll catch you in the next one.